Yo, what's going on everyone? This is A Train Game, your conductor speaking. Welcome back to a brand new Let's Play Banjo Tooie. Oh, oh shit, wrong game. Alright, alright, oh my god, I'm so sorry about that. Jeez, I, I, I don't know what that was. Um, yeah, yeah, anyways, welcome back to another Let's Play. Um, uh, gonna be starting Banjo Tooie today. And yes, this is Xbox 360 edition. You can see that 2009 Microsoft Corporation. Look at that, huh? Yeah, all rights reserved. Look at that. Now we can go ahead and collect all these jiggies, man. And you know, look, uh, sort of a different interface than uh, Banjo Kazooie. Remember, you could pick from like three different banjos, and he was in his house doing different things. This one got a couple of. Uh, New features here. We got a. Uh, oh, I don't know what the. I don't know what the SNS means on the pictures, but oh, stop and swap. That's what that means. But here we got multiplayer, and then you can replay games and features. And I actually think the radio. Uh. Oh yeah, and then you can copy a game. You could do that in the other one. But I'm pretty sure the radio did something in the N64 version. It might do something here. I don't know. And then you see the you see the copy of Banjo Kazooie nuts and bolts in the background, even though there's no Xbox in this this room. I don't know how you're gonna play that. That's what the game's getting at. 360 game in the background, but there's no 360. They're telling you not to play it. <laughs> All right, so yeah, game one, 70 jiggies. So I've never actually 100% completed this game, man. But uh, I'm gonna try to this time. But let's get into this cutscene. I don't want to interrupt this. This is epic, alright? So let's go. Let's do this. Alright, you know what? This isn't that much of a cutscene. We can talk. It's not that bad. Mumble will play well. Has much of his cash. Aha. Uh -huh. He's right, Kazooie. There goes your bird seed. Money. Dang, he has nothing, man. Hey, look. Outside, everyone. Grunty the Witch is coming. Oh! <laughs> everyone got scared. Where is it? Where? Oh, I, I, can't, I can't. I remember Bottle's voice from the first Banjo Kazooie Let's Play. Come on, Boneface, let's play. You see, Mumbo has like a a decently new character design now. Outside, it's dang man, it's raining hard. The sky looks dangerous. Like man, I've never seen Spiral Mountain looking like this. And I don't think, if you play Banjo-Kazooie, I don't think the wall looks like that there. It might, I don't know, I've never actually went over there in Banjo-Kazooie to look at the wall to see if there was like a bunch of rocks. Oh shit. Stop rocking the table, you're making me sick. <laughs> I'm gonna rock, table, whole house shakes, lot, lots. <laughs> Perhaps one of us should go take a look outside. Is that goldfish over there? What in the world? Oh no. Heavens, no. It can't be. 
that drill is 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 having an aroma of green come off it. Oh, there's an aroma of green coming out of it too. What 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 could this mean? Oh no. Uh, quickly, we must go. Kill me, must or move. I cannot. Huh, they don't rhyme. What's up with that? What's up with that? Let's stop now. Sure was noisy. Let's go take a look, Kazooie. But but it's dark out there, and um, I'll be scared. Oh my god. Now I'm gonna just change, I see. Back in minutes. Look at this guy, he's so brave. He just warped out of the house right there. What a sucker, huh? Come on, Banjo, give me a hand. Oh, look at this. Kazooie. He just swiped Mumbo's cash. He G-snatched that shit. Sorry, mistress, I have failed you. I'll look at Mumbo in the background. Get you out of your sister's will. I don't know what she's saying. Like. Look at those boils on her face, miss. Grunty's sisters, you should not mock. Now watch our magic blast this rock. Oh, they're okay, they're rhyming. They're rhyming a little bit. That's cool. Alright, now they're just waving their hands. Oh. Wingardium Leviosa. <laughs> Gone Rock has. I don't know what she said. Look at those polka dot undies she's got on. Oh no. This is supposed to be an epic moment, but the rain kind of looks like, like, static marks somewhere. Nice, Grunty looks lost. Wait, you have. This little deed. Ooh. It must go. Look at Mumbo back there. Girls, let's fix me up. And Banjo's hairy butt. Ah, whoop. Look at that scarf. I didn't even know she wore a scarf. This is not good, Migo Tell Banjo. Oh, he's gotta make a run for it. <laughs> Why is he not running that fast? Look at how fast he's running. He's like going walking speed. I'll kick butt then off to the castle. She's <laughs> look at how she's running too. That's like walking speed. <laughs> Oh shit, listen to that music. Guess I'll be having that bird seat after all, huh, Banjo? But you cheated, Kazooie, that's not... What kind of money is that, anyway? Those look like the doubloons from Jolly Roger. Must run, pant, quick, grunty, coming. Oh, that music. Furry fool dodge this. That average music, is the music messed up or something? What's going on? Yeah, yeah, schoolboy, and I bet she had two heads. No joke, look. I think the music is a little off. He's right, quick, everyone out. I'm not falling for that. Where? Trick again, I'm staying right here. Where, where did they go? Did they go out the front door? They're, I know there's no back door. Where did they hide? She just blew up the freaking... Hold on, sis. I'm nearly there. 
I've just been to blast that bear. That's how dull as hell reading these dialogue skits. Troops, we will leave, destroy area, they will. Alright, so we got some new enemies here, look at this. Yeah, no doubt, the music's off, dude. Like, it definitely does not sound like that's where I should have played that song. It's not, like, the... The noise of the character talking is, isn't off. Like, they're talking when they're supposed to, but... It's like the music in the background is off or something. Look at Klungo, forced to... To follow her for all eternity. Yeah, see, like, that's not where that music's supposed to play. What the hell is going on here? I'm pretty sure, like, the dun 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 is supposed to play right here. Look at our house. Well, at least everyone got out safely. Yeah, like, where did they go? There's no back door. There's, there's just rock behind their house. And how did Grunty not see them if they came out the front? You can't, you can't question this, this game's logic, man. I, I said that too many times in Banjo-Kazooie. This is a Nintendo game, even though it's not Microsoft now. Nintendo logic. Oh. Yeah, see see that music that's playing out? It's supposed to play when the, the camera was zooming on them. It's worse than that. See, and then like the, the ghost music's supposed to play right now. He wasn't the favorite character in Banjo Kazooie anyway. <laughs> hey man, he taught us everything. Grunty Wreck House and Kill Bottoms. She must pay. Bear and Bird get after Witch. Mumbo, see you later. Alright, man. Great, I get to pick some more Witch ass. Let's go, Banjo. Sigh. I have a feeling it's not going to be so easy this time. Dan 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 dan. See? I'll just put in my own music. Dan 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 dan. dan. Hmm. Yeah, that's what's supposed to. Alright, now the music's back to normal. God damn it. <laughs> Alright, look. Look, I can still see my old dirt piles. Press B to interact. Alright, yeah, so. I don't know, if you've never played Banjo-Kazooie, or you didn't watch my last Let's Play, or you've never seen anyone play it before... Um... Basically, in the old game... Oh, okay, hold on, cutscene. Uh, cutscene killing my vibe right now. Oh, great, it's this guy. Stupid bear and bird coming, we need to wait for them in here. Look at this guy, shaking that ass. All right. Anyways, like I was saying, in the old game, these um, mole patches you could find them throughout Spiral Mountain, and you could also find them in levels. And uh, bottles would teach you a new move, but uh, we don't actually have to go around and relearn them. We actually still know them. So you mean, you know, LT if you're playing this on the 360 version, LTRT, Talent Trot, the most useful move in this game. And uh, all that jazz, and um, you know. Oh shoot! Hold on. Help! It's me, Royston. I was knocked off the barbecue and ended up under this rather weighty boulder. Please get rid of it. I can hardly breathe. I think he said. I don't know. I didn't really see. All right. Yeah. A X to do this move. L T or R T and X. Do that. And then there's some boots over there. Those we learned some of those moves and. But we're not gonna, you know, come on, you just run into them and you can use them. Uh, you know, LT or RT and A to do this big jump. You know, just X to do like the somersaults. Uh, you know, all that good stuff. But you know, we don't, we don't really need to do anything here, so let's just go. Let's just go. Follow Klungo into this strangely dug cave. Alright. Oh, that music though. Minion with a mission. 
It isn't the bear and bird who caused so much trouble to Mistress Grunty. I don't recall anything like that happening. Uh, uh, you is stupid. At least we can speak. Oh! <laughs> oh, Klungo's mad now. Your game ends here, bastard. Oh, what the? Oh! Oh, my guy. Looks like he's big now. Alright, just hit him. <laughs> Alright, yes, yeah, that's it. That's all you gotta do is freaking hit him. Special potion, just run. Look at this. You can't... You can't tell me that at least you haven't faced a boss that's done that in your life. I, I know there's... I think, remember, um, Kanga from Mumbo's Mountain and, and uh, Banjo-Kazooie? Like, he'd throw the, the oranges just behind you wherever you ran. That happened, yeah. Three times, that's that's pretty much every boss in, in a Nintendo game is like you hit them three times and they're done. Alright. Nasty bear and bird hurts poor Klingo. You asked for it. Why don't you run off and we'll forget this ever happened? Uh, good idea, but uh, you you're not seeing last of Klingo. Uh, Klung Klungo coming, mistress. Um, please beat, uh, failure. Klungo with broomstick? <laughs> she even have a broomstick anymore? Well, what the? Who the fuck was that guy? Alright, where am I supposed to... Okay, this, this way, this is where I'm supposed to... Let's do it, do it, do it. Yeah. Look at these, look at these graphics, man. I mean, they're not the best, but I, I will say one thing. Microsoft did take this game and enhance it quite a bit. So, it's, 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 it's pretty good. Uh, I wonder what this place is. This is brand new to Banjo-Kazooie right here. This is one of my silos. Open up some more to create a network of shortcut tunnels. A network? Oh. <laughs> All right, so all right, we got some houses here. What what is what is this? Let's go in here and see if anyone's home. They're all gone. Come and see me in my throne room, and I'll tell you what happened. This is my palace. Not bad, eh? Oh shit! Just come on in and oh shit! I didn't finish his dialogue. God dang it! Come on, Alec. Get with the picture, man. Stop hiccuping. All right, yeah. See, we got the, the the classic gold eggs. We got the the blue eggs. We got the red feather. Did I just say gold eggs? I meant red. I meant gold feathers. There we go. We got red feathers, gold feathers, blue eggs. Yeah, all those all those classic banjo kazooie items, man. That's what I'm talking about. All right, so let's just. We heard what that guy said, and here's his throne room. So let's just kick it. Let's go kick it. Go cool it with this guy real quick. Oh, I went in with Kazooie. I was. It, it kind of looks awkward when like Kazooie's in the Talon try and you're talking to people in like a cutscene, because like Banjo talks and he's just turned the other way. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. It's always awkward to me. Yo, what's up? <laughs> I'm King Jingling, King of all the things, Jinjo, and ruler of this village. The kingdom seems a bit. I don't know what he said. My people were scared anyway by those witches and their giant machine. I kind of like it quiet, but I need to get them all back for the kickball tournament here next week. Doesn't seem that important to me. But it is, Joe. This, kick, this big kickball rivalry between the Jinjos and the Moles, bruh. Which means there could be trouble if we don't turn up. <laughs> turn up? Exactly. Anyway, here's an incentive for you to rescue my people. Oh. So he's trying to bribe us to get his people back by giving us a Jiggy, that's cool. I believe you should go and see Master Jiggy Wiggy in his temple, man. Jiggy who? Jiggy Wiggy, bruh. He's the leader of a secret and ancient order, dedicated to the mystical powers of the Crystal Jiggy. Ancient order? Crystal Jiggy? You just made that up, didn't you? Nah, bruh. Honest. It's all true. He's very important to your adventure. There's only the Crystal Jiggy can open the worlds that you must enter. Can you show us the way, King Dingling? 
It'll be my pleasure, bro. Oh, who's that? He's got the uh, Pokemon hat on. <laughs> Ash's cap. All right, we're getting out of here. We we exited the Talon Trot, and we're we're hightailing out of this piece. See you later, bro. Not bad for a king, huh? Yeah, his strange pet thingy was cool. <laughs> Let's go and find that Jiggy Wiggy then. To be continued. Meanwhile, meanwhile, uh, look at that background. It looks like you're like in a box world, and like the background is just like a box design. <laughs> Doesn't even look like a sky with clouds. Oh man, what is going on here? Come on, sisters, time I lack. What's the plan to get my body back? Annoying your rhyming is, so stop it, or we will not tell. Ah, fuck it. If I must. <laughs> B.O.B. This is Big O Blaster. Built by Mingi and me, life force from ground plants. Ooh, the creatures. Ah, shit. Stored in big tank life forces, shower and grunts he will take when tank full. That new body you will have. Yeah. An evil and heartless plan, I like it. How long will it take to suck up enough life force? Why do you sound so dull when you read these dialogue? Not slim you are, so plenty will be needed. So start blasting. Patient you must be. Targets you first must pick. Yoda, boy. You sound like Yoda. Hmm, that cursed jingling has just given the furry fool a jiggy. I reckon we should blast the Jinjo King. How does she know? Auto-targeting Bob has button you only have to press. Oh, that music cannot be good. Uh-oh. That poorly designed electricity cannot be good either. Warmed up B.O.B. is, so begin with a firing sequence. Oh! Ah! What in the world is going on? Target B.O.B. has here at Stale Life Force. He will. Unlucky B.O.B. was bear we just missed. Ooh, dang, what if we were in there? That'd be crazy. Never mind him, what about that traitor jingling? Dang, what if we were in there and like, it sucked the life from us and we got to play as, as zombie Banjo-Kazooie? That would be awesome. That would be freaking awesome. Oh, look at, look at his pet. <laughs> Turned to dust, but his eyeball is still, still there. Successful B.O.B. was. Jingling's life force we have. Grunty's life force. I like how they set that up. Right then, girls, let's blast the whole island. This we can do, but big charge up B.O.B. will need. Ah, always a catch. Hours it will take, and revenge Bear will seek. Ha, huh. I wouldn't worry. Banjo's got no one to help him now that Mole and Jingling are gone. He'll never get to us in time. <laughs> Alright. Well, you know, this, this video has gone on way too long, man. I doubt anyone's even going to watch it. So, I guess I'll just end it off here. If you enjoyed it, subscribe for more and remember to one-up that like button. Thank you all for watching, and sayonara.